Hey guys, what's going on? Welcome back to another reaction of Death Note. I know you guys have been actually waiting on this series, man. I wish I could do, you know, a ton of episodes for you guys, man, and just put them all up, but unfortunately, time does not care. <laughs> Anyways, so what's been happening in Death Note? We got a second Kira on our hands. And she has a Shinigami eyes. Um, and also, as, as I was saying in my last review, I was talking about that would, if she takes the life of the Shinigami that saved her, basically, you know, the Shinigami falling in love. I, I'm, I don't, as I said, I don't think it's a falling in love kind of thing. Like, you know, romantic love is more of like, you like the person so much you think their life is worth saving. Plus, she was a little girl. So, as I said, I don't think it's a romantic kind of love. It's more of a caring kind of love. As in, caring for a human um, and giving his life for that human. Or maybe he didn't know. Who who knows? They're supposed to know how they how they. I guess they don't know because the way how the sh her Shinigami is talking and make it seem like she had until she saw that she didn't know how Shinigamis die. You know what I'm saying? So I don't think they know how they die. Maybe Ryuk doesn't know how Shinigamis die, but she got an insight into, you know, a possibility of how Shinigamis die because she saw it for herself. So the death note that this girl has um, is the sh that Shinigami's death note? So it belongs to her in a in a in a, in a way. It it belongs to her as her Shinigami has told her. So, um, Light is going out, try going to try to figure this out. Now he's working with L. So I don't know how he's going to figure out how who it is. Um, at the end of episode twelve, they were in the same restaurant together. But I don't think they know who it is. You know? I don't think they know who it is. So we'll see how things turn out, man. We we um we're gonna jump into this, jump into these reactions, man. I'm I'm down for it. This story is so intriguing and you know what I'm saying? The the, the okie dokes, the the um the here I am, but not so much, you know what I'm saying? Very surprising. The writing, man. The writing in this series is top notch um so we're gonna jump into this man so i'll see you guys for the review a possibility of three episodes today but we'll see what happens or where i end up or what time it is when i finish two but if it's two is two if it's three is three um three is not a promise so let's jump into it i will see you guys for the review I don't know anymore, man. This this anime, this <laughs> it's all I can say, man. It's just is I'm just in awe of the writing in in this show. It's it's just it's so refreshing. It is so refreshing to see a mind. You know what I'm saying? A mind being made, a, a mind being brought to life of a vision being brought to life. You know what I'm saying? Um, things like this has happened to me personally before where I have a vision for something. And when I see it come through, it's such an unbelievable feeling, man. When you can share that with others too, it's, it's an amazing feeling. So I can imagine when this was adapted into an anime from the manga, or even from the manga, from when the manga dropped, I can imagine how the artist felt, the writer felt, man, um, with the reception, because I can imagine how the reception of this was absolutely out of this world, where, you know what I'm saying, maybe even to the point of unexpected, you know what I'm saying, so overwhelmingly, I wish, and, and this is one of the things too, I hate to go off 
on a you know a ta- uh, um a tandem about certain about this area of um when it comes on to um eastern entertainment um when it comes on to I'm, i i I want to say let let's go all the way to when we're talking about anime specifically right uh, there's a lot of stuff that goes on behind the scene that we don't that we know about but we don't really understand you know like why certain shows get more publicity than some and all this other stuff you know and it's the same bureaucratic bullshit that happens in in Hollywood you know what i'm saying why you would think that i'm pretty sure there's a lot of anime out there that i have not watched and the reason why i have not watched them is because i never heard of them right and they're really good animes you know you know what i mean like some of the ones the suggestions that you guys are make i've never heard of these animes before never heard of them but apparently they're very popular among the anime community now we know that one punch man kind of broke that barrier that was there you know what i'm saying so now so many people including reactors on youtube celebrities all these people now they're interested in anime so now they can get the shine that it deserves you know what i'm saying like you know the dragon ball um broly movie you you know what i'm saying getting the recognition that it deserves the awesome movie i loved it and it just goes to show you man that it's a new time and a new age where as in back then these a lot of animes wasn't getting the, the recognition they deserve especially for i wish soon and coming soon they're gonna have like a category like at you know what i'm saying like for a category at like the emmys for for anime that would be totally awesome you know what i'm saying i know we have um that would be awesome and a great accomplishment for the anime community the, the, the anime creators the um the manga creators um for writing these beautiful stories man of going into the mind of 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 some very smart people because in these three episodes that i just watched is some of the greatest writing i've ever ever witnessed and i'm speaking to you guys from from a perspective of someone who has who has written stuff you know what i'm saying who has written stuff who is currently in the process of writing something you know what i'm saying and not just for because i do i do um public speaking and all this other stuff that i use to help people and stuff like that i do that you know every now and then you know but i'm also in the process of doing some other things that's what i'm telling you guys when i tell you guys i'm busy or if you know you don't get a reaction trust me when i tell you that i need a a, a day break or a couple of days break or i sit in front of the camera and tell you my head is busting open you best believe that's the situation <laughs> because when i say i'm non-stop i'm on my grind for these next 10 years um because i want i want to retire early i want to retire early so i'm busting my ass sacrificing a lot to get some things done before that time right and YouTube is one of those grinds that I picked up and I have to do it just the same. And as I'm saying, you're going to see me more than you don't. But if I do, um, if I do take a little time off, don't come at me as I know you guys don't. But I'm just saying, you know what I'm saying? Like you guys are extremely supportive. And I love that because you guys understand because you don't want to see me burn myself out. And I totally get it. Um, but. This is some of the most amazing writing I've ever witnessed in an anime. This is absolutely on another level when it comes on to writing. And there's no, there's no action. So to keep an audience engaged, keep an audience engaged in something that you watch weekly with no action, it's not an easy thing to do, guys. I'm telling you this. It's not an easy thing to do. It's absolutely amazing what they do with Death Note. The writing, you know, the things that happen in these three episodes, man. When you're talking about the um, the girl showing up at Light's door, you know what I mean? Like him finding out who it actually is. The whole thing, how, 
how Elle found out that it, that it was her, that she's the second carrot, right? And then stealing her cell phone, Light calls the cell phone, you know what I'm saying? And now he's the number one suspect. Um, so what is he going to do now? What's next? You know what I'm saying? You guys watched it, man. I can't even stop talking about the writing because it's so, so good. Like, what, what is next? What are you going to go? It's just unbelievable how good the writing is in this story. Unbelievable, man. It's on another level, man. It's on another level. You know what I'm saying? It's on another level. And as I said, man, L reminds me so much of Sherlock Holmes. It's not even funny. It's not even funny. It's like he is Sherlock Holmes brought to life from the Sherlock Holmes novels. It's just unbelievable. Like I'm saying, the whole thing about L telling Light that he's his friend they playing with each other man it's all part of the play everything that l does no wasted words just the same as light no wasted world words R right now right now l is proving how smart he is and in in certain in no uncertain terms right now he is the smartest of the two because he keeps doing stuff that to keep to um light every time light one ups him he goes up to two notches and that's why i believe that l not just because i want l to win in the end um it's just because he's proven to be that he's the smarter one keeping things away from light keeping him close cuz he's making him feel safe by telling him oh I think you're the first friend I've ever had. Kind of make him let his guard down and all of that stuff. So, I mean, the situation that happened with Misa, man, it's mm, they make they making you sympathize with someone who is outright evil. She killed innocent people, man. Like there's we, we're not going to sit here and forget that she killed innocent people and they're making us sympathize with her. It is it, it's it, I felt it. I felt it for her, man. And that's what this show does, man. It, you know what I'm saying? Because even though she did it, even though Light is doing what he's doing for his own morality, own moral reasons why he's doing what he's doing, it's still wrong. Evil never cancels out evil. It never does. Love is the only thing that cancels evil. Evil will never, evil just becomes stronger if you add more evil to it. It doesn't solve any problems. As you can see from his perspective right now, it's like the more things you think you're doing that's right just brings more attention, brings more people paying attention to to what you're doing and, and they're not going to be saying it's cool. It's not cool what he's doing. But the thing is written in such a way where you're like, you're so conflicted on who you should really be rooting for. And that's and that's another thing that I love about it. So this was great, man. Great episode. Um, three episodes you guys got today, man. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, this anime is out of this world. I'm so glad that they decided to adapt this from, from the manga. It was awesome. Can't wait to watch the next episodes, man. Thank you guys for watching as always. It's your boy Terabyte Reacts. I will see you guys for the next one. Don't forget to like. Leave a comment in the comment section. Peace.